So it is Vlogmas Day. Oh my gosh, it's probably Vlogmas Day 23. Uh, I just want to stop and say hi. I haven't had much time to vlog at all today. And that's partially not because I haven't had content, you guys, because I've been doing stuff with the main channel. Because I've spent most of the day building a gingerbread house with the main channel. And you can check that out. I made a Smith Tower out of gingerbread, so that's what's going up there. Also, because I've got some surprises coming up and I spent most of the day kind of coordinating those things. And it's not much of a surprise if you get to see things early. Mm -mm, it doesn't work out that way. However, uh, I didn't want to miss out on Vlogmas today, so I thought let's talk about best ever holiday presents. Let's talk about that. Um, one of the best presents I ever received when I was a kid was my three CD changer. I had the boom box. All these words probably mean nothing to you guys. CDs, so before MP3 players, you got these roundy discs and you put them in and they'd spin around and they still sell them. Um, but having one that did multiple changes was a really big deal when I was a kid and that was the, one of the best Christmas presents I ever got because I like to go and like turn on my Nirvana really loud. It was a thing I used to do, so that was always fun. And that was one of my favorite presents. Another one that was a really big deal for me was when I got my Super Nintendo, but really when I got my Nintendo Nintendo. That was a really big year for me. When Nintendo happened originally, it was just so new. It was such a new technology. It was kind of like when iPhones happened the first time, when FaceTime happened the first time, or when any kind of new tech happens where it just kind of opens up the world. That's how um, Nintendo felt to my generation. So uh, that was a really big year. I really wanted to get um, Super Mario Brothers 2, but instead I got Dr. Mario, and so I learned kind of puzzle gaming early, and and as a result, played a lot of Dr. Mario. It's a good game. It had great commercial. If I can find the commercial, I'll see if I can leave a link in the comments below. Take on an old song. Anyway, Nintendo used to do great, great commercials. If any of you are like gamer, game geek oriented people, you should go look up uh, video game commercials from the 90s, early 90s, really wonderful. A lot of the things that have been the most meaningful for me at Christmas time have been, in, have not been presents, but have been like moments with friends. Like there was one year I went and I saw some reindeer, like some actual reindeer with some friends. I've had a number of like parties with friends that happened around the holidays that I always thought was really nice. I used to do caroling a lot when I was a kid. I also used to do a fair amount of going and doing volunteer work, singing, choirs, I sang in a lot of choirs. And now it's very simple moments. Now holidays are having a good cup of coffee and being with friends. And someday I'd really, really like to go to England for the holiday time period and see like Christmas in England. That would be really cool. This picture for me and Michael at the photo booth. <laughs> I've really been enjoying this particular vanilla chai body butter. I like that it is, I really like chai during the holiday times and that's really taken off in the last year. So it smells exactly like really, really heavy vanilla chai. So I like that. I've mentioned two of the older candles, but I did buy two new ones. One of them is seasonal. It's this Twisted Peppermint. I love Twisted Peppermint body lotion because peppermint is really soothing, I find, especially for my feet because I walk a lot. But the smell is so good that I got this candle, and it's one of those, like, I feel like I can open this and you guys should be able to smell it. Like, you guys should be able to smell it right now because it's that strong. Ooh, it smells just kind of like peppermint, but a little menthol -y too. It's nice. I got this Tony Moly Cream Foam Cleanser. New background noise. I think there's video games happening downstairs. This is called Sweet Holiday and it doesn't actually smell at all like gingerbread, which is a little disappointing, but it smells very clean and it has a lot of shea butter in it, or almond butter. I think it's actually shea butter. It has a lot of it in there, so I was really hesitant to use it, but what I've been doing is doing like a normal facial cleansing routine and then adding this on afterwards, kind of like nighttime lotion, early nighttime lotion. So I'll do like a normal clean, then I will clean with this. So I've got like a little bonus lotion level and then I'll come in and do like my night lotions. That's been really cool. And I really dug it. It's made my face really soft and wonderful, so yeah. Yay!